So, how's your day? You enjoying the fights? Looks like James and Bryce are fighting. Oh, the sheriff is interrupting them. Two sheriffs. Both of them are knocked out. Maybe I could loot them. James, I am going to take your clothes. What's up guys, my name is Sir Buckhead and welcome back to The Escapist 2. Now today's video, we're going to try to escape Kapow Camp. We could do one of two plans. We could either cut our way through the vents and go to the motorcycle room or dig our way to the motorcycle room. You know, both are similar. I'm probably going to dig my way there because I've already started making a shovel. I don't know how long it's going to take to repair that motorcycle. Hopefully not too long. Hopefully we escape today. So let's get right into it. Okay, it's currently free time right now. We're on day six, and in the last episode, we stole a cop's costume, and we could basically steal from desk now without getting caught. But I think in this episode, we're gonna have to do some side quests to get some coins, and then we could start buying stuff from everyone else, because I'm pretty sure I already looted all the desks. Okay, we're gonna do a favor for Cinnamon Toast Ken. He's never been so betrayed before. James stole his secret crush. Put this dead rat in James's desk. Okay, we'll do that for James. I'm sure he loves rats. Okay, we're going to try to accept as many missions as we can so we could get tons of money. What do you want, Avery? Okay, it's currently a roll call right now. Let's gather ourselves, make sure we have everything. We still have that rat for James. We're probably going to have to put it in his desk soon. But I can't go through his desk without people watching me. I'm going to have to put on my cop uniform. I'll do that tomorrow morning. Okay, let's see if we could upgrade this flimsy shovel. Yeah, we can! Okay, now we have a lightweight shovel. And I think our next best bet is a sturdy shovel. A sheet of metal and some duct tape. We need 60 intelligence though. We only have 57 intelligence. Alright, let's go to sleep now. Let's gather ourselves. I think I need to put a blanket over where I'm digging at and I'm probably gonna have to dig at night because cops can see when you're digging in the morning. Okay, we're gonna do Cinnamon Toast Ken's mission now. We're just gonna take our clothes off, put our guard uniform on. Uh oh, I think I accidentally changed right in front of the security camera. That's not good. Okay, now let's put this dead rat in James's desk. James! You have some duct tape for us. Thanks. Let's see if we could find a metal sheet and then we're basically complete, right? No metal sheet here. I'm gonna have to find a way to cover the hole though. Okay, we found a metal sheet. That's good. All we have to do now is gain three more intelligence and then craft the best shovel in the entire game. It's probably not the best shovel, but it would do good for us. Okay, now let's hide that there, that, and that. We don't really need molten plastic anymore, so we could get rid of that. Let's go to the bathroom, and let's put on our prisoner outfit now. Okay. Let's go to the library. Oh, it's currently breakfast time. I should probably put this in my hidden compartment. We're going to miss breakfast time. We're gonna gain half a star, and now it's job time. I'm a plumber, right? Oh, God. People keep flooding toilets left and right. I guess that's what happens when you eat slop every day. I wonder what slop is made out of. That's disgusting. Let's grab a plunger. And let's get to work. Okay, so here's the plan. We already have the best shovel we could use right now. So all we have to do is get smarter and learn how to craft that shovel and then we're gonna have to find out when's the best time to dig a hole and we're gonna have to find some energy drinks just in case and we're gonna have to find something that could cover the hole so where is the library okay it's currently exercise time we went there and we gained three intelligence by going to the library for a few seconds now all we have to do is craft that shovel of ours and Dig at night? I don't know when's the best time to dig. I also don't know if I could cover a hole. So this is where we're gonna dig. 
You know, to be honest, digging probably isn't the best plan. Using cutters probably is. But since I've already built the best shovel, I'm probably not going to go back to cutters. Currently free time. Let's go to our house and let's craft that shovel. Okay, this sturdy shovel is basically the best shovel in the game, right? There isn't any other better shovel except for a multi-tool, which we're not going to use. Okay guys, look here. You can make a fake vent, so if you want to cut through a vent, you could always place a fake vent so no one gets suspicious and repairs it. Or you can make a fake wall. I can't see any fake floors though, so that might be a problem. Okay guys, so it turns out you can't really cover holes unless you use your desk. And it turns out the desk can't really fit through doors, which is bad. We're gonna have to find something smaller. Okay, it's currently dinner time right now. How did the day go by so fast? We didn't do anything at all. Uh-oh, I had contraband on me. I had a shovel on me. I had a shovel on me. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Don't shoot me, don't shoot me. I spent so long on the shovel. Oh, this is bad, 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 this is bad. Go, go, oh, oh. Okay, we put the shovel in the desk in the hidden compartment, right? Right? Okay, I seem to be running into a problem every episode. Last episode, I couldn't come up with a decent plan. This episode, I've came up with an alright plan, but we've run into a problem. Can't really cover the hole, and we don't know what time to accomplish our plan. Like, a cop could shoot us at any minute during the morning, right? And we can't really dig at night because we have to be in our cells at night and if we don't go to our cells at night, lockdown starts. And if lockdown starts, we get shot. And if we get shot, we lose our shovel. And if we lose our shovel, I am so done. I have a great idea. What if we wear our guard outfit and dig a hole during the morning? This is either going to be super smart or super risky. Super risky because I could lose my uniform and my shovel. Super smart because I might be able to escape. Okay, it's shower time. There's a few dead bodies. There's a guy with a bear hat showering over Michelle's dead body. We are going to take a little shower next to Ryan. This isn't awkward at all. Why are you following me? Why? Am I like on parole now? Oh, people are getting beat up. You know, I think I know why he might be following me. He has 17 opinion of me. Let's uh, give him some money. He might be a dirty cop. Let's see how much money we could give him so that he would stop following me. 50 coins? 67 opinion! Okay, we're gonna do it. We are going to do it now. Oh my god, I totally forgot about energy drinks. We probably need chocolate. We're gonna try to do this one round. Old box, never mind. Let's not do my plan. Let's go to roll call. I found an old box. I found an old box. Could I cover a hole with an old box is the question. Okay guys, so here's the plan. We found an old box. We may be able to cover the hole with it. If not, we're still going to do my plan anyways. My plan is to get our cop uniform, get our shovel, and dig during the day. Cops aren't going to shoot their own, right? This should work. Hopefully it does. Okay, but first we're going to have to go to sleep. Can't do this during the night. We don't want to go under lockdown. Okay, it's the morning. That happened really fast. Let's see if we could buy anything from this guy. No, I really need energy drinks, and I have tons of money. Let's see if anyone wants to sell me anything. Energy drink, 140 coins for energy drinks. Come on. Okay, we have a can of soda. That should do us well, right? Hopefully. Breakfast time. Okay, let's do this. Get the chocolate. Get that, get that, and get that. First, let's see. Can I... 
No, I can't place the old box down. So that was a waste of my time. Well. Okay. Here goes nothing. This doesn't work. I don't know what's going to work. Probably nothing. Actually, if this doesn't work, I am moving on. I am not completing this level anymore. Okay, we're doing pretty good so far. This plan is actually working. As long as they don't cover up the holes, we're going to be good. Can't carry any more items. Just drop the dirt. Okay, we went under this wall, I think. Let's just dig up now. No, we have to go through one more wall. This might be bad. Our shovel is almost dead. Can't carry any more items, dude. Come on, we have to do this. Uh, just drink your energy. Nope, we're going to, we're gonna drink or eat that. Okay, we are at 20% right now. Why can't we dig up? Why can't we dig up? No, no, no. Come on. Can we seriously not dig up because of those tools in front of us? We are going to have to build a better shovel. Okay guys, you know how I said I was gonna build a better shovel? I quit, I give up. This level is so crap. Let's beat up a cop. We are a cop. We're beating up another cop. Yeah, I quit. This prison is so done. We are going to move on to a new prison. Hopefully a cooler prison. Let's do this. Okay guys, welcome to Rattlesnake Prison. This looks horrible. Oh, maybe we could escape on a horse. You know, and sorry about just rage quitting the other prison. I, I just didn't feel like doing it anymore. I couldn't find any more plans. I didn't feel like making up any more plans. And that prison was getting pretty boring. And I didn't want to spend another third episode in that prison. So, we're in a new prison. You know, this place doesn't look all that rough. You know, there aren't military people walking around. Just cowboys. The old Wild West. A whole bunch of security cameras. Oh, you just said something important. That might be a place where we could escape. We have our Halloween mask on, okay. Okay, we're not sharing a room with anyone and... Oh wait, we are. Hey, uh, where's my partner person? Are they waiting outside for me? No? Are they dead? You guys are probably the sheriffs. Quiet, all of you. Okay, Bryce, you have a sheriff's badge, which is apparently a weapon. That's good to know. Let's go explore this place. Holy crap, we're on the third floor. There are three floors here, and it looks like this is the roof. Good to know. Now it's breakfast time. I wonder what they serve in this prison. Cowboy slop? You know, the kitchen looks pretty nice. Okay, Bill. What are you serving today? That looks like eggs and bacon. We're just gonna sit down with these people. So, how's your day? You enjoying the fights? Looks like James and Bryce are fighting. Oh, the sheriff is interrupting them. Two sheriffs. Both of them are knocked out. Maybe I could loot them. James, I am going to take your clothes. Bryce, I'm gonna take your milkshake and your glue. Ow, 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 why are people punching me? I'm just trying to loot them. Ever heard of looting? People do it all the time in Fortnite. I currently have four sheriffs chasing me right now. Why are you shooting me? This is my first day. Come on. We learned another lesson. Don't loot in front of sheriffs. Hopefully we don't get on James and Bryce's bad side. We're probably going to have to pay them off. I still got that milkshake though, <laughs> and I still got James's clothes. Okay, as we go to job time, we should probably formulate a plan. 
Are we going to dig our way out of this this time? Are we going to cut our way out of this? It looks like they don't have any electric gates. So we might be able to do a really easy escape like in the first prison. We're going to have to find the best exit point, which I'm going to do right now. The best place to cut out of. Hey, uh, James, it looks like you got some clothes back. Uh, would you have a higher opinion of me if I give you your old clothes? Eh, good enough. Okay. Let's see where the outer layer of the prison is. Okay, so that looks like the main entrance. We can't really go through there. We need a gray key. It's exercise time right now. Oh, that's smart. We can't cut our way out of this prison. They have huge thick walls. What we can do is get a huge pickaxe and try to escape from there. Except these walls look like they're double layered. So that might be a problem. Okay, so our best plan right now is to get a pickaxe and break through the walls. But I kind of want to find a fence. There isn't any fences. Oh, oh, come on. There's a wall right here, and then they have like an outer wall over there. We're definitely gonna find a better plan. We can't cut our way through this. We can't break our way through this. We can't dig our way through this because digging is so boring and it's so tedious too. You know, I remember the tour they were giving us earlier. There was something about an old shack. Okay, so this is where the shack is. I'm pretty sure they said that their tunnels were weak or something like that. Hmm. Tunnels weak. Does that mean there's a bunch of holes in the ground? Are they implying that I should dig my way out? I don't really want to dig my way out this time. Okay, it's currently lunchtime right now. We are going to go to lunch. And then I think I want to steal from other people's desk. I'm pretty sure they don't have a security camera in every room. So this is going to be way easier. Why are people fighting? I swear every time we eat a meal, someone just has to fight their way through. What is that? Push button. I need the right key card. Oh, so someone has a key card. That's good to know. Okay. As you can see, there aren't any security cameras. So, we're just gonna steal through this guy's desk. Turns out, it's James's desk. Thanks for the chocolate, thanks for the drink. The overpriced drink. Bolts, we probably don't need bolts. James has a lot of mechanical stuff in here. It's really cool, we might keep an eye on him. Okay, let's see what his partner, Cinnamon Toast Ken has. Just a file and some more toothpaste. I don't think we need any toothpaste and I think we're going to keep the adrenaline shot. Those are pretty good. Okay, so this is the map. As you can see, we're right here. And if we want to escape, we're going to have to break through this wall. We missed job time. And we currently have five stars. Why? I didn't do anything. I didn't do anything. I only missed job time. Does missing something instantly give you five stars? Why? So I'm guessing in this jail, they're really strict. Can't miss any jobs. That's bad. That's really bad. They also took everything out of my inventory, even that adrenaline shot. That wasn't even contraband. Oh, come on. Guess what? What? What do you have to say? You're not that interesting. Yeah, you bore me. I'm trying to do my best here. You haven't listened to a word I've said. Come on, I've been listening to you. Thanks for the money. Okay, job time's over. Now let's try to find a way to escape. I really want to find a decent plan before we end today's episode. It's currently shower time. We have to go to shower time or we're gonna get shot on sight. This prison sucks like all prisons. Kids, don't go to prison. Unless it's like a five-star prison hotel thing, which I'm sure they have. Probably have it somewhere. They should add it to this game. You know, guys, I think our best bet right now is to get rid of these sheriffs. 
pretty sure if you kill enough sheriffs, the front door will open. This is our best chance. This guy's already beaten up. Oh, come on! You're a fellow prisoner, why'd you beat me up? Okay, so I'm guessing beating up sheriffs, not a good idea. We're gonna have to find the best way to escape. And we should start by looking at the map. Okay. So, each corner has a guard tower. And currently we are trapped inside of this big bone box. You see that huge thick walls over there? And then once you escape those thick walls, you're going to have to get through these thick walls. And you can't really go through those thick walls when there are guards shooting you down. So, we're going to have to find the best exit point. There's solitary. What's this room? Let's go over there. Let's, I'm pretty sure we're going super east right now. Okay, so near the stairs, there's this room over here. And if we break the walls, we could go through that room. And then go through the vent. Oh. You know what might be a good idea? Go through the vents at night. You know, I really like how the cops give you an in-depth map on how all the vents work. So where is my room? Okay, this is my room. My room doesn't have any vents. Yeah. Why doesn't my room have any vents? That's bad. Okay, we're returning to our cell. Our friend is still missing. Do we even have a friend? Yeah, it says Evan's desk right here. Evan should be here. Where is he? I have no idea, but he left. A weapon for us okay I've been searching around this prison for like 30 minutes still no plan our best plan right now is no plan just beat up all the cops that's our plan right now don't really want to beat up the cops they're probably gonna kill me and if I kill one of the cops the second one's probably gonna kill me I think we're gonna have to dig our way down there but that's gonna take a lot of shovels oh there's a note over here I wonder what the note says. Some help for y'all. Don't forget to use your map for areas to exploit. There's some small buildings outside of the prison, but still within the outer fence. Now I ain't seen anyone go through them. That'd be a good stop off point for anyone digging all the way out of the prison. That's good to know. Okay guys, I think that's gonna be enough of the Escapist 2 for today. And usually these videos are pretty hit or miss. You do something either really interesting or something really not so interesting. In today's video, we tried to escape from Kapow Camp. We couldn't really do it, try to get a shovel, dig our way through. We got beaten up, we lost, we rage quit, and now we moved on to Rattlesnake Prison, which I can't find an escape. I'm probably going to have to do a lot of research. You know, recording these videos, it's pretty fun, but sometimes when you're sitting here for an hour of recording and nothing happens, it gets really frustrating. So if you guys still want to see some Escapist 2, just let me know. If you guys don't want to, I can always move on to a different series, something you guys might like. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.